Hi, I'm Anthony Romrell, and I'm continuing to talk about key commands in Maya. So, key commands in Maya, really important key commands. First thing we need to do is switch ourselves to the Polygon menu system. And let's just draw a cube. I clicked on the cube icon here, and I'm going to click once and drag, release, and click again, and release, and there's a polygon. So this is a polygon cube. Now let's talk about manipulating the polygon. So a few key commands that are really important. The first one is we're in wireframe mode. In wireframe mode, if you want to switch to a shaded mode, we're going to switch here to by hitting number five. We hit number five on the keyboard. We go to a shaded mode. We hit four on the keyboard. We go back to wireframe mode. So that's five for shaded, four for wireframe. You can also have other options here. You can see if I click on this icon, I get shaded or wireframe. Or I can also get one of my personal favorites, wireframe on shaded. Turn on the shading, you can see the wires on the shaded view, which is really nice for modeling. Next set of key commands are the QWERTY keys. So the Q key, the Q key is used for selecting only. If I hit W, it gives me this widget right here. This is the move widget. Some things to know about the move widget. Number one, if I hit the plus key, it can grow the widget size or the minus key can shrink the widget size. So if you're ever in Maya and you're stuck with this large widget, you might want to just hit the minus key on your keyboard. Next you'll see I have green is for indicates the direction of movement in Y. And if I select that, it'll highlight yellow. Blue is Z. And red is always X. And any time I, I have a selection, it changes it to yellow to tell you that that is my current selection. I can also select in the middle this blue one, which started out yellow. And this will let me select and move in all of the directions. So W, again, is the key to get to the Move tool. If I hit Q, it'll move me back to Select Only. The next key is E. E stands for rotation, and you'll notice the same widgets. If I grab the blue, the blue line represents rotation in Z. I also have rotation in X. Excuse me, this is rotation in Y. The green line represents rotation in Y. And the red line represents rotation in X. So Q is select, W is move. E is rotation, and then the last one is for scale. That is the R key. You hit R, and I'll get the scale widget. All these still, remember, if you hit plus, grows the widget, minus, shrinks the widget. Same with rotation. If I hit E, I can grow the widget, shrink the widget. So hitting R again to scale, I can scale globally in the middle, or I can scale in Y, or I can scale in X, or I can scale in Z. Again, that is Q, W, E, R, plus, minus.